hello everyone welcome back to my channel my name is ruth and in today's video i will be talking about the reasons um, why i love living in azerbaijan i've been living in azerbaijan for almost eight years and i will say this uh, these are the reasons i'm talking about five reasons why i am still in azerbaijan Um, the first reason why I love living in Azerbaijan is the hospitality. The hospitality, it is the number one. Like, they are welcoming, they are kind. Oh God, I don't know. They solve, they will solve your problem even though they don't know you. That's how welcoming these people are. People will be willing to um, invite you to their homes like... It's just it's strange. It's strange because um it's not all um culture that accepts this kind of things. But in Azerbaijan, it's very normal. Even in my comment section, uh, my previous video, someone was like, "Oh, if you're in Baku, come around and I'll invite you to my place. We we'll take tea, chai." Yes. So really, Azerbaijan people are very very welcoming. They want to help you in all ways. I don't know how to explain this, but. I've encountered some bad ones, but I would say the good ones are more. I've encountered more of 80% of Azerbaijanis are very, very, very nice. Well, let's say 20%. It's normal in all, uh, in every society. But in Azerbaijan, oof, these people, they are welcoming to, to visitors. Like, when they see you, you're having problems. If you have just little problem, any problem, even maybe you miss a document or trying to do this, they will help you. They will even tell you, don't worry. It is for free. Like major majority are like this. They want to help you. So this is the more reason why I love living in this country. The second one is um, safety. Azerbaijan is very, very, very safe. I don't know how to say this. I can stand up around 3 3 a.m like 1 a.m i want to go outside to do something or go downstairs to buy something or go for a walk like that is how safe azerbaijan is some countries are not like this in azerbaijan if just i don't know but it's just i've never been in a situation where i feel unsafe that kind of a thing I've never been in a situation where I feel distressed, like maybe I'm 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 fighting for my life or I mean my life is in danger or my safety. In Azerbaijan, Azerbaijan is very, very, very safe. Very, very, very safe. In some other countries, I know women cannot go out like when it's almost um 12 o'clock. But in Azerbaijan, you can do anything. Like you can do whatsoever you want at night. Nobody will bother you. Even though you like, want to take a two hours drive to the city center, like, see, just do your thing. Nobody, nobody will even mind you. So that's just how safe Azerbaijan is. Like, I've been living here for seven years or eight years, seven years to say eight years, and I've never encountered a situation. I was thinking about it not too long, whereby I'm like, I need to call the police. I need to call on someone because I am not safe. It's, it's, it has never been like that. Like, it's just, that's that's the reason why i love this country let me know i love the country it's like it feels like my second place my second home like that's how it is for me then the third reason why i love living in azerbaijan is the cost of living the cost of living is affordable i know some people will be like no 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 but for me i think it's affordable it's it's really reasonable transportation transportation is affordable and it's very efficient like i would say it's it's trustable you can it's convenient you can use the bus you can use metro you can take taxi it's uh, the public transportation is quite affordable if you want more comfort you go for the taxi but for the bus it's very very comfortable if you about to enter a bus and you see the bus is filled up like you can you can also you know just wait for another one in another minute it's gonna come so that's how convenient it is um about food and food stuffs it's very very affordable i know now is um the pandemic happened so things are quite like shaky but still compared to some other countries it is very 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 affordable very very affordable um apartment renting apartment also it's very very affordable depends on 
in the money you're holding now it depends on how much you want to spend so any amount you're looking for you surely find it so it's i think it's affordable compared to some other european countries so yeah i know in some countries some people pay monthly about almost one thousand dollars for some apartment but here it's it's just yeah you find you find the one you're looking for it's very very affordable even if you can't afford um some um apartment you can look for private apartment you can look for hostels so that's how affordable it is um yeah so that's it about the cost of living you can you can survive on little little amount of money that that's just just in summary you can survive like that so if you budget well you definitely survive um so that's just about it the cost of living is very 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 affordable and i know in the capital of baku it's it's more expensive than in some regions and i heard that in the other regions it's very 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 cheap especially food um the products are very 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 affordable so the next reason why i love azerbaijan hmm, is the people are family oriented the people are family oriented they love they come together to celebrate they come together to to do things like even i heard like they live together to just the bond is still there even though you are married the bond is still there. i know in some in some culture one the the person is married and you leave your family you go to the other families oh they won't even see each other again maybe till when there is a celebration when there is a um a celebration or something that will join them together party that's when you see that person but in azerbaijan it's like they keep in touch till like every day i see they'll see they will see each other every day that's how the bond is these people are just and that's one reason why i love the country unlike some other countries they don't really care about family well i don't i i'm not saying they don't but not to the extent of some cultures like in my country nigeria we, we see <laughs> we love like we love gathering together we love doing things together family is number one like there's this um um this um some celebration we used to do like everyone will come from different um different countries like christmas new year my uh, when there's a, um, a party everybody comes together in nigeria we love family like uh we can't we can't we can't just <laughs> we can't just abandon each other like that but Azerbaijan too, they are like that. They love, they love family. I would say even more than my country. They are more family oriented, more than Nigeria. So that's one thing I love about them. So the last reason why I love living in Azerbaijan is Baku. Baku is beautiful. Oh, Baku is beautiful. They really they really did well <laughs> the country is beautiful like any every like if you go outside anywhere you want to take pictures like you want to do something because everywhere is just instagramable like when i'm instagramable it you can take picture anywhere and it will look as if you're in paradise that's how it is <laughs> for me oh it feels like i'm in paradise other people might not feel like this go and check my instagram my instagram feed yes if you have if you are not following me on instagram what are you waiting for go and check my instagram feed and you know i like taking pictures i like taking random pictures i just i just love it it's therapeutic for me when you see my pictures and see how all these pictures i that are on my feed are the pictures i took by myself so it's just everywhere i go i want to take pictures i want to do something like i just have different ideas like baku is too 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 beautiful like you know i love the structures like if you know flame tower um the area Aliyev, um center the um the old city the maiden tower and all the good places in azerbaijan i will put some pictures for you to see and you see how beautiful and neat how baku is so that's all for this um video before we leave <laughs> thank you thank you thank you guys for the love so far on my channel i don't know where this is coming from but i'm very 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 grateful for see we're almost at 1000 subscribers we see listen we are almost at 1000 subscribers so yes let's see let's let's reach 1000 we're almost there it's just like 20 percent more let, let's just 
let's let's reach there so the goal is before july 25 we should be we should be almost 1000 subscriber right we can do it so please like share and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video bye